Well, we can only control what we can control. And that's to come back uh, with a great attitude and to send our seniors off as winners and finish uh, nine and three. And nine and three seasons don't come around very often. And uh, so we're gonna get back to work and do what we do and we'll be ready to go on Friday. Well, we had a you know the big play with Keto, but you know hats off to Ball State. They did you know some different things with drop eight coverage. So uh, you know you're not going to get the, 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 the big play, and uh, their corners are very very talented. And uh, so you know it may have, some of it may have been us, but probably a lot of it was them and and, and uh, the schematically and the things that they did. Um, I've said it. This this is. Uh, a great place. I think you saw the passion of uh, the Mount Pleasant community and area. Uh, Central Michigan University, our student body was outstanding. You know, for me, that's what I sit up here and you asked the question earlier about, per, you know, does it bother me personally? I hurt for our, our kids and I hurt for our student body because uh, they came out and they supported us and it was a great showcase for the Mid-American Conference. And that's why we go play in the Motor City Bowl and we have 60,000 plus fans there. Our fans travel everywhere we go. Um, they're passionate about CMU football. And uh, when we go to the bowl game, we'll sell a lot of tickets um, because our, our people are passionate about what, what we do and they want to see us play. And you know, that's what we told our, our players in the huddle um, when, we, when we went out for that last uh, time, the 58 seconds left is all these people sat out here in the cold to watch you guys play. And, and to be in this fight with it. And I just can't say enough about uh, everyone that came out tonight.